Hello, it's still Jess here, and welcome to another Minecraft video. Today, I want to show you something really cool. Now, before I get to the bottom of this, I just want to say that I did not build this contraption. This was actually made by a guy called Pingy Puck. His YouTube channel can be found in the description, or you can click here or press the I button. Now, to use this contraption, all you need to do is throw down a ticket here. Thing will go down. You grab your ticket and you head out. Then you want to go back out. You just hit this kind of this is um, trap door and you can go out. But what happens if you put something other than a ticket in? This is a fake ticket. Just throw it in. The piston will not go down and you'll get your ticket back. Now, just do be aware that it can sometimes spew out like so. So, um, uh, be careful of that. But otherwise, let's get straight down to the nitty gritty of this machine. This contraption is actually pretty small. It is only 8 by 4 by 6. That is 8 long, 4 wide and 6 tall. And you can put two side by sides without them interfering each other. Now, to, to build this, you need the following. Magenta wool, orange wool, and light blue wool. You can use any colour of wool you like, or you could use null, none wool at all. But uh, I suggest you use wool because it, it lets you easily find out problems. And you also need a dispenser, a piece of glass, your, your building block of choice, a button, an iron trapdoor, and a hopper. And you also need redstone, a redstone repeater, a redstone comparator, a redstone torch, a sticky piston, iron bar, your, or your choice of iron bars, or glass panes. Any one will work. So, without without further ado, let's get on with the tutorial. So you want to get things started with a 8x4 area, and this is where your floor is going to be. So, um, first of all, you need your orange wool, just place three like this, then one here, and place one up, then one like this, and then one out. That's your orange circuit done, now let's do the light blue circuit, just place one wool here, and then a wool here, and here, and then a wool here, here, and then extend it like this, and place one up, destroy that, and place up like this. For the magenta circuit, you need to place wool like this in an L shape. Then go up one here, place, and then up one, and then down one. Then you will need to place blocks up like this. And more blocks up like this, and more blocks up like this. Like you make a a tunnel, then place a block there, a dispenser there, and f and some glass at the top like this. Then you also need to p destroy this block and this block and also this block. Then destroy this block and this block. No, nope, we don't. And also you. M you may need to destroy this block. Now for the redstone, all you need to do for this orange circuit is pretty simple. Just place two redstone like this and a redstone repeater. And then a redstone torch like this. And then redstone like this. Comparator. And a redstone repeater. Set it to four ticks. Then you want to place redstone under here. A more Some other redstone and um, a comparator like this and another comparator like this and a redstone torch. The magenta circuit is a bit complicated but the main principle is that you place a comparator like this and then a redstone repeater like this and then do redstone up like this and then repeater, redstone, redstone and more redstone. Now for the hoppers. Place a hopper here and here, facing into the dispenser, and then a hopper here. Then you'll need to place a hopper here, a hopper facing into this dispenser, 
like here and then you'll also need to place a hopper here and here and then up like this here so if you're up to this you might want to prepare your uh, floor so go go ahead and do this and um, you also need to place more components such as this piston here nope nope piston here and place an iron iron bar here and here and then a block here iron trap door there and a button there so you can open the trap door then you just finish off the um floor like so the next step is pretty easy the anvil part you just have to place your paper in the anvil and rename it ticket now in this anvil you'll need to place a ticket here 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 and here then 18 tickets here if you want to know click right clicking until your uh, total stack becomes 42 like so now here's to set it up you just simply toss a ticket in here it'll pull down but the ticket won't uh, get dispensed that's fine just toss another ticket in this one will get dispensed and it all works now so all's left to do is just cover the, the whole machine like this this will stop any intruders from getting in they can't jump the uh, uh, trapdoor or the iron bar so there you have it guys that was pingy puck's subway ticket machine with a tutorial made by me i hope you enjoyed it if you did please leave a like it'll always be appreciated and make sure and also subscribe for more videos so i hope you enjoyed and i'll see you next time goodbye <laughs>